Hello everyone, welcome to this video where we are given a quadrilateral ABCD. And on this diagram itself, there are many things that we are going to construct. The first will be perpendicular bisector of BC. So I'm going to focus on the line BC. Taking out a compass to draw a perpendicular bisector. We need to make sure that this distance here is more than half of this line. Okay. Now place the pointer tip at one of the point. And I'm going to draw an arc on either side of this line. It should be somewhere in the middle. Okay. Move this pointer tip to the other point making sure I don't change the distance here. At any point of time, you can actually turn the paper, okay? And you realize that it should cut the arc. There are two intersections. And from here, I could then join the intersection points with a ruler. And do label part A. This will be the perpendicular distance uh, bisector of the line BC. So part A done. Part B, construct the angle bisector of angle BCD. BCD, it is this angle. So at the angle, we are going to place the pointed tip here. And do make sure that this the distance from the pointer tip to the pencil, you are able to cut the lines that make the angle. So in this case, it's CD and CB. Okay, I'm going to cut. I'm going to just adjust. I'm going to cut one point here and one point here. Now place the pointer tip to the intersection. Draw an arc here. Now move the pointer tip to the other intersection. Now you notice they don't intersect. So what should we do? We move this back up here. And we make it longer such that it can cut. Because then, from the intersection to the angle here, is where I'm going to draw the angle bisector and this line will be part B. Done. Part C. There's a point E that is inside this ABCD but it is nearer to C than B. Okay? And also nearer to BC than CD. So now I know this E must be this side here. It cannot be here. So definitely it's somewhere here. And yet, at the same time, it is nearer to the line BC. That means it cannot be, it must be below or on top. Below, yes. Because below is nearer to BC. Ma. On top is nearer to CD. Ma. So the only place will be this region here. Where E can be any point in this particular region here so that it is nearer to C than B because of this dividing line. And it is nearer to the line BC compared to CD. And this will be my Part C. With that, we have come to the end of this video. If you like this video, do give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.